We are so fortunate to have 37,000 acres of parkland in Montgomery County and 271 parks for our residents to experience and enjoy. As the council's lead on parks, I worked alongside my colleagues to ensure our parks department has enough funding to maintain the open spaces that are so vital to health and quality of life. We're protecting the most vulnerable in our community by supporting the vital work our nonprofits do every day as partners of this county government, bolstering security and improving mental health services to keep our kids safe, secure, expanding mental health services for youth in crisis at times when they are most isolated and alone, restoring funding for those who do the necessary and often extraordinarily difficult work of assisting those with emotional and developmental differences. Well, this budget has been a whirlwind. It's definitely been a learning experience for me. I've been around budgets for quite a bit in my career, but obviously being on this side of it's a little bit different. But my highlight was uh, being able to get $5 million in additional funding into the Housing Initiatives Fund to really tackle our affordable housing crisis, to make sure that we are not falling backwards, but actually moving forward and maintaining uh, the progress that we're making to keep up with the need to have housing for all of our residents and keep that affordable uh, so that it's as accessible a community as possible possible.